Welcome back to another Dollar Tree haul. I know I said I wouldn't have another update until probably next year, but I said if we happen to go to a Dollar Tree and find movies, then we would do one. And yesterday we went and to found Dollar Tree. to Dollar Tree. Uh, you can also check out Rousey's video looking at them movies and a few other things that we looked at Christmas stuff there. Links in the bottom of that. Go check that one out. And I uh, got three Blu-rays and seven DVDs, and I don't think we've really seen any of them except for one that we watched last night. As soon as we got it, and I've already seen it, and it was Horrible Bosses Part 2. So funny, so good, better than the first one. Yeah, it is pretty good. Yes. Uh, this is the extended cut. I don't know. I can't remember. I watched the original, I mean, the original cut, I guess, theatrical cut. I don't know what all they added into this one, but yeah, th funny. these guys are funny. Big time, uh, what's his name? Dude, right there, Bateman Jason, yeah. And you had Jennifer Aniston, Jamie Foxx, really Hilarious. funny. Yeah, this is. I hope they make a third one, that would be even probably better than that. Now, this one, I don't know if this is the second one, third one, or what. I have never even seen none of these. It's got Ice Cube in it, uh, Cedric. Barbershop, the next cut, uh, Cedric the Entertainer, like she said, is in it too. Um, at the top it was a dollar so we a picked dollar. it up yeah we want we need to get some more <laughs> comedies in our uh, collection here so uh yeah the next cut i don't know if it's the second third one i don't know mm -hmm. i haven't i ain't seen any of these have you seen them yeah it's been a while but yeah and the last one has uh rosie what's it rosario. rosario rosario dawson and Catherine hagel yeah <laughs> anyway there's that one this is called unforgettable I uh, don't know why I really picked it up. It just looks like something like it says when love ends, madness begins. It looks like maybe a stalking movie. Some kind of stalking type. She's the stalker and that's the couple or whatever. Or maybe he left her or some shit. I don't know. But uh, it just looked and it has, you know, good cast in it. So had to pick it up. Uh, this is one that I found. She, and you know why? Well, because it's a dollar. It's a dollar. <laughs> Next up are the DVDs. This one says One Serial Killer, 12 Personalities, The Nightmare Begins. It's called The Basement. Don't know nothing about this. This one's a blind buy. This is one that I found and put in the stack. Uh, next oh, yeah. one. Most of all these are blind buys. This one looks crazy. I seen it. Uh, what was this? It's on Instagram. A lot of people have been posting this movie. Yeah, a lot of people post it, but. Uh, Harmonator 76, I could not think. He posted it. It's got Laura Flynn Boyle in it. It has to be good. Yeah. Hansel oh and Gretel God. get baked. I don't know. <laughs> I mean, he, the, the, you know, this might, it's got to be better than the Gret, Gretel and Hansel movie that we right. watched. They had that one. That was crazy. But they get baked in this one. So I don't know. We had to grab that one. The next one is the one in Mystery Science Theater 3000 Presents The Undead. I basically got it because of the cover. Looks like something Rob Zombie or something. I don't know. It's just crazy looking artwork. Mm -hmm. um, but I think the movie's in black and white, it looks like. Probably so, one Rousey won't watch. Yes, yeah, so it looks like it's probably a really old movie. But I remember watching the Mystery Science Theater when I was younger and stuff. So uh, who knows? I'll check that out and see what that's about. It's been waiting. Lake Fear. Look at this one. I like it because of the cover. Yeah, it's a pretty cool cover. Uh, it looks like a cabin in the woods and a little lake there, and who knows Small what goes lake on. Or something. Yeah, so I don't know about this one. It's a blind buy, too. Uh, another one, we have the first Ouija. Ouija. A Ouija, or however you want to say it. This is called the Ouija Experiment. I don't know if this goes along with that first one, or uh, this is a different series or what. I don't know, but we did find that. And what well, this one's called Ouija the Summing Summoning. Mm -hmm. It's kind of hard to get the cover in there. There we go, the glare and stuff. But, but uh, yeah, I don't know if they go along with that. But I do like uh, any kind of movie about Ouija boards and stuff. Uh, so uh, I remember JT of the Dead asked me, did I have any of these? Because I think he might have picked them up or he was talking about he's seen them. And uh, I said, yeah, I had them. Well, I only had the first one, but. So, like I said, I don't know for sure, but we'll have to check these out. Mm -hmm. Of course, these definitely didn't come to the theater like the uh, other one did, I'm sure, because I never heard of them. I hadn't either. And the last one, mm -hmm. it was the very first one we picked up. The Super Bowl. Rousey found this one. Yeah, Super Bowl champions, Pittsburgh Steelers. 
Uh, it's a two disc. And I think this is kind of old because it says four times Super Bowl champion on the back and they're actually six times. So this is probably about 10 or 12, maybe 15 years old, the footage and stuff. And it shows back in the, I guess the seventies when they won the Super Bowls and stuff. So, but uh, that's it. Seven DVDs and three Blu-rays. Mm -hmm. Probably could have got more. Uh, Rousey got down in there and digged through them and stuff, but I was trying to be good and not get too damn much. I was on the much. floor digging through the boxes because they had them at a, sh uh, a shelf in like an odd aisle. They weren't even in the front of the store. We were just getting ready to leave in the video, if you check out her video, and uh, I just said, oh, look. And uh, she got all excited. It was all <laughs> in the floor. So she got down the floor, and then some other lady got in there and started digging through them too. But... Um, they finally hit our area. It's one of our newer uh, yeah. Dollar Trees that we have. The other two we checked out, they don't have any movies right now. So we did hit one. Maybe they'll have some more at the the other one closer by us. Mm -hmm. So this is a few miles down the road across the, uh, well, almost across state line. Right. That's over in Bluefield. But uh, that's it for the Dollar Tree haul. DVDs and Blu-rays. And go check out Rousey's video for the new location in our area. Till next time.